Hey guys, I just wanted to walk through what I think is the best way to take a lyrical track and a instrumental track and combine them for the easiest editing. Um, I use multicams and this is how I do it. Let's dive in. I'm gonna take these two songs. This is the instrumental, this is the lyrical. I'm going to multicam them, use audio to sync. Easy. You can do this in Premiere or Final Cut X, boom, and it creates my multicam. And all you have to do is take that and drag it down here. Drag it right above there. Um, the important thing is to see exactly what is browser out, angles on, okay. So right now it is on the instrumental one. So I'm going to Go to the beginning of the song and change it to the lyrical version. Um, I think lyrics come in right here. As well as I welcome the challenges of whatever obstacles we face, because I know that we face it together. I vow to hold on tight to the love that we have and continue to grow that love as long as we both shall live. I All right, so there's some lyrics right there. So what I would do really simply is come in here and maybe cut right here into the instrumental version and then apply a quick crossfade. Doesn't have to be anything super bougie or cool, just a crossfade. And tight to the love that we have and continue to grow that love as long as we both shall live. I promise to encourage you in your dreams and your aspirations. I'll be with you. So let's say right, yeah, let's just say right here is where we want um, the vows to end and the lyrics to come back in, just for easy editing. I'm going it's to, I can tell there's audio right here. With you. Cool, so that's almost a perfect cut. I'd like to apply uh, transitions just to smooth out anything I may or may not be able to hear. Keep them real small. I can't wait to start this amazing adventure with you. Cool, so let's say, um, let's say we want to ha go back into more vows over here. Um, again, it's just as simple as cutting back and forth between the two. Um, no stacking, muting, anything like that. And if you have more of a tricky transition, um, like let's say I'm gonna make a cut right here. If you have more of a tricky transition, I'm not sure about um, Premiere, but I know in Final Cut X, you could uh, click expand audio and you could do custom, um, you know, maybe like you need a longer trail on the other one while this one fades in fast. Maybe it's like a cymbal swell that's going out long and you're looping a chorus or something. So you don't have to apply the default transitions. Um, you could do custom as well. Uh, so I'm gonna undo that and then highlight these and collapse audio. Anyway, so super simple video and just wanted to share that with you guys. Um, it's my favorite way to uh, cut back and forth with instrumental and lyrical songs.